So I recently got this Kylo Ren lightsaber from Art Sabers, and it comes with these cross guard fire blades. And it also came with this 36 inch pixel blade, but it did not come looking like fire. So I'll make my own. So I'm not using anything special. This is just crap I had laying around the house. It's clear silicone for windows and aquariums. So the first thing I'm gonna do is put the blade into the hilt and make a little mark so that I can mask off so that no silicone goes past that point. And that's it, let's get going on the silicone. So I'm gonna start just over the masked part. I'm gonna actually try to not get anything on the mask, but at least it's there and I can kind of remove it after. So I really don't know how well this is gonna work, so I'm gonna grab a quick um, paintbrush and I'm gonna use the back side of it and I'm just gonna kind of dab and push and dab. We're basically sculpting fire and the great thing about fire is that it does not in any way need to be perfect. It just needs to be messy and imperfect to just let it do what it's gonna do. All right, and this whole process is basically rinse and repeat. Make another line, make another two lines, um, and you're just gonna kind of dab and push things forward. If you want the flames to kind of push forward in the direction that I am going right now, because it's coming out of the hilt, so you gotta remember it's going forward, so you don't want the flames to kind of, you know, twirl backwards or anything. Now, as I get towards the tip here, I do feather and thin it out a little bit, so it's thicker towards the base and it's thinner towards the tip. And then we just keep repeating this whole tapping and kind of push forward technique here. Now, this is such a super simple process that no joke, the whole process took only maybe 20, 30 minutes in total. Now remember, once you come towards the tip of the blade, you wanna make it much thinner so that it comes to more of a point rather than very beefy at the base there. All right, that's about it. We're just gonna hang this up to dry for a few hours. I gotta say, I originally did not know if this was gonna work out well, but this looks so great. It really brings this lightsaber to life. So if you have this lightsaber, think about doing something like this. It literally only took about a half hour. I did this with clear silicone that I just had laying around in my garage, but you might even be able to find better materials. Thanks so much for sticking around, and if you enjoyed this video, please drop down, hit the like button, subscribe, and hit that notification button for new videos coming out. Be safe and kind out there in the world. See ya.